I'm a younger sister of the best sister in the world. Her name is Maddie. My sister Maddie is awesome and so brave. She doesn't have a brain that's like most of our brains. You see, she had a brain tumor removed as a baby and has epilepsy and other health conditions because of that. Things that we take for granted aren't always easy for Maddie, like they would be for most of us. When other kids are in karate and dance and stuff like that, Maddie would be at appointments to help her brain do all the amazing things it does, like occupational therapy or physical therapy or speech and language or aquatic therapy. She also has some very sad experiences in school. One story of bullying that happened to Maddie doesn't just make me sad, but really mad. Remember when I said that Maddie has epilepsy? Well, she had a seizure at school one day. And I don't know if you've ever seen a seizure, but they can be very scary. Maddie knew this one person. She thought they were a friend. This friend made fun of Maddie for having a seizure. But she didn't just make fun of Maddie. She recruited other kids to make fun of Maddie. That didn't sound like a friend to me. I felt so bad for my sister Maddie. It's scary enough to have a seizure, but then to be bullied and made fun of, that's even scarier than the seizure. I didn't know what I could do to help Maddie and all the other kids are needing help with bullying because bullying doesn't just happen to Maddie. Unfortunately, bullying has touched nearly everyone's lives. One day, I saw the idea of a buddy bench from a boy named Christian in Pennsylvania. He saw the idea from Germany. What a buddy bench is, is a bench on the playground that kids go to when they're feeling lonely, wanting someone to talk to, or someone to play with. And they would go to the buddy bench, and then other kids who have been taught through the schools, they would include the kid to go to the buddy bench. They'd offer their help, their support, and their friendship. Most people would say a kid could never do this, but we don't do never in our family. Because mom was told that Maddie would probably never walk or talk, but Maddie walks and talks. I know we're all capable of miracles, but I just needed to find my miracle. Well, my miracle came in the form of Claire Cares. I was hearing from others who were victims of bullying, me, of bullying, which started as one buddy bench on my playground, went to me wanting a buddy bench on every elementary school's playground in the tri-state area. How can I fund not just one buddy bench, but the more than 23 buddy bunches that we're working on? Because this nine-year-old does not have a paying job. <laughs> That's where, again, Claire Cares has been my miracle. The community has come together to help support and fund my 23 buddy benches. And that number keeps growing. I needed a way to sustain my mission. And I needed to get more kids and community involved. That's how I started Claire Cares Monthly Buddy Playdates. What a Claire Cares Monthly Buddy Playdate is, is people, we come together, we build friendships, we do friendship building activities, and we do a give back to the community. At a recent Buddy Playdate was hosted by a local movie theater. Our give back to the community was, we asked each friend to bring a new unwrapped gift or toy for Toys for Tots. Together, the 90 people that came, we filled Santa's sleigh with toys for toys for tots. The reason I added the give back to the community was because if you feel good, then you'll make others feel good. Then everybody will feel good. Then we'll all want to build friendships to end bullying. When Claire Care started was January 22nd, 2014, with me, my mom, my stepdad, and four other people who believed in my vision. But you know what? Now there are more than 23 schools in a whole community that believe in me. But they don't just believe in me. They believe in my mission, that together we can and will change the world by building friendships and making our communities a better place. What I have found is that by starting something, others will follow and support your dreams and miracles. So my message is dream and dream big. Let's get busy and spread friendship and kindness. Let's all be miracles.